Well, I can't believe it. I have officially reached my three year anniversary here on YouTube. And yes, before I do get started, if you guys do notice, I am here behind a green screen because I figured for my three year anniversary, why not try to get a green screen? And I figured this being the first video ever on my channel, I use a green screen. Why not use it on a special video like my three year anniversary video? I want this video to be special because throughout the three years I've been here on YouTube, there are a lot of people out there that I have to really thank, whether it's been them helping me or how they influence me and just people I've gotten to know throughout the three years I've been here on YouTube. And first of all, I just can't believe that I made it this far on YouTube because as of July 27th, 2015, I hit three years. And I remember in July 27th, 2012, if you guys can see right here, I was a shy guy. I remember that night, I was so scared to press that record button because I was just really doubting how I'm gonna do my YouTube thing. It turned out I had confidence build up very slowly, and I do mean very slowly, because you could tell it's really iffy in my old videos. And then also, as of July 28th, I did reach 1,700 subscribers and I just have to say thank you so much for that you guys thanks for helping me reach that milestone 1,700 subscribers in three years is insane it is nuts and um, I wouldn't be here without you guys I really am very appreciative of that and I know people get way more subscribers in three years but honestly me reaching that many subscribers and the three-year milestone I've been on YouTube it really is such an honor so I have so many that I actually have it written on this notebook and the first channel I have to thank because this is the channel that literally put me on the map and that channel is we live film First of all, I want to thank Scott Menzel and Matthew McKeague. These two are the ones that found it, Scott Menzel being the main founder. I want to thank Scott Menzel so much, and I'm going to be forever grateful to him because he is the one that brought me into We Live Film and let me do videos for the channel to help my channel grow more. And it's because of him that my channel is where it is today. So. Um, forever I'm gonna be grateful to We Live Film. If it weren't for We Live Film I wouldn't have gotten to be introduced to all of these wonderful people. Uh, Movie Man Chad, Real Chase Lee, Brian Sudfield, Big Gabe from Stuff for Real Entertainment, Mark Krawczyk, Austin Putnam, Rokan Alzir, Zachary Strobel, That Movie Nerd, Zachary Marsh, Jose Romero, Joe Caldwell, and many more great YouTubers. All great people that, you know, whether I talk to them a lot or not, I've gotten to know them. And the next channel, I have to thank, of course, I'm a part of this collab channel. I do my videos there. That is Universe of the Blue Tubers. This channel started on July 3rd, 2014. And I was recruited when that channel started. I think I was recruited to join that channel, I believe, two weeks after it got started. The founders for Universe of the Blue Tubers are Seb Carrasco, AW Universe, and Brian Mendoza. They are the founders of the channel, and they have been so, so thoughtful of actually thinking of bringing me to be part of that channel and I just love being part of that channel and of course I also love being on that channel with WWE Fan 0599, J53518 and Jacksig99 great people I love doing videos for that collab channel I love collaborating with the others Seb, James, Brian seriously guys thank you so much I'm blessed to actually be on Universe of the Blue Tubers you know the fact that you guys actually even thought of me that makes me feel good that makes me happy universe of the blue tubers um, that's the channel I have to thank for helping my channel grow helping the increases and you know it's, it's just an awesome channel so thank you so much you guys you have no idea how much it really means to me next person I have to thank he's just so awesome 
I love talking to him. That is Mark Krojic from his channel, Mark Krojic, or The Final Cut. Since February of 2014, I've been a part of his podcast called The Spoiler Room. The Spoiler Room is a podcast where Mark Krojic is your host, and then me and some of the regulars, um, we all come on and we discuss things, and it is called The Spoiler Room because it does spoil things in a certain movie. Like say, for example, we did a Guardians of the Galaxy spoiler podcast where we do spoil Guardians of the Galaxy. And not just the um, new releases, but he even does the podcast on like the older films as well, which is really cool because you expand your horizons there. And he himself even does a lot of movies. He reviews a lot of movies that not a lot of people are going to be known for, which is cool. But I think Mark Krojic, because not only does he bring me to the spoiler room, but it's pretty much the first podcast I've been a part of. I'm pretty much a regular for it because I do go on the spoiler room quite often. And that spoiler room has helped my channel grow a little bit, you know, because of him expanding his spoiler room on his website. I believe it's Special Mark Productions, and he even has all of his spoiler room podcasts on iTunes so he's expanding more on his channel but um, the fact that this guy even welcomed me to his podcast and pretty much made me a regular there I am just so grateful um, he is so nice to talk to he respects people's opinions that's what I really respect the guy for so Mark thanks for having me part of the spoiler room thanks for making me feel welcome and if it weren't for him I wouldn't have gotten to meet all of these nice people that are on the spoiler room like Scott Davis and Glenn Buettner and Don S and Cole Meredith and Paul Selzar, William Holt, um, Joe Caldwell, and possibly more from there. So yeah, thank you very much, Mark. You're a very cool dude, and it's because of you um, my channel has been growing. Next one I really need to thank is J53518 because I've known this guy since high school, and um. I met him around freshman year. I think he was like a senior at that time. After that, I haven't seen him for a while, but then I got back in contact with him. So I think it's cool that we both went to high school together um, and we both have YouTube channels and we both have the same birthdays. <laughs> but this guy, you know, he's always been very supportive. He's been very supportive to my channel. He's been very, I've been very supportive to his. Uh, we talk a lot. We've been very good buddies. And I want to thank him for whenever we would collaborate because in the earlier days, when we both pretty much got started because we started around the same year, uh, we would collaborate and do things together to help each other have our channels grow. I have him to thank not only for just being a very good friend since high school, but also for collaborating with me and even his live Q&A's I almost forgot to mention this but he's also the reason why I actually had the confidence to talk to other youtubers I have him to thank as well so Jacob buddy thanks for always being a good friend thanks for your huge support man and um, yeah thanks for always being there for me buddy you're a very good friend the next person I have to thank is Adam Haskell Adam Haskell I have to thank him for because he actually did the 2014 voting competition. You no, know, I announced the winners for the nominees. I helped my channel grow a little bit because of him. And I have to thank him because if you guys would watch my Valentine's Day series, the Valentine's Day King, which are videos I would post every Valentine's Day, he actually made a spin off series. It's called Adam and Rex. And well, it's more of a spinoff of my third Valentine's Day King since that one seemed to have more of a short film style, I guess you could say. The other two were all like six minutes long, four minutes long. It's really my third one because that one's like kind of like a short film style, I guess you could say, even though I consider it more of a special. But yeah, 
Adam and Rex is a spinoff of my third Valentine's Day King video. Somehow um, he actually made a little bit popular for me. You know, I guess the Valentine's Day King has a calling and I have to thank Adam Haskell for that. And also the guy supports me big time, like big time he supports me. He always tells me how he views my videos, how he likes them. And um, he'll even leave comments sometimes here and there. So I always appreciate his support. So Adam, thank you very much, my friend. I, I really do appreciate it. And speaking of award shows, the next person I have to thank is Caleb. Now Caleb, he started on YouTube around February of 2014 and he has been um, supporting my channel ever since. He was actually just watching my videos and then later on he would talk to me and you know we eventually um, meet each other and Caleb is a really cool guy ever since then we would talk a lot on Facebook message so yeah he's a nice guy to talk to but I have Caleb to think and I know some of the youtubers know this um, he did the Film Fanatics Awards the first annual Film Fanatics Awards because he really wanted to do this award show but he didn't know much youtubers so I would help him get the other YouTubers out there and pretty much get this award show running and thanks to the YouTubers that were presenting the awards the award show turned out to be a hit so of course thanks to YouTubers for that and thanks to Kayla because since I got to present the award show and I guess be the co-helper for the award show you know that really helped my channel grow a lot and just his support on my videos he loves to talk about movies he's not afraid to express his opinion and he is making his first feature-length film called living with trevor and which i think that's great that this guy's even making a film i completely respect him for that so thank you so much caleb i really appreciate your support buddy next person i want to thank is Justin watches movies. The guy you see me collaborate a lot on my channel. We've done a lot of movie collaboration reviews together. He's done spoiler reviews with me. We've been really good buddies. He's someone I would talk to a lot on Facebook. He's a very cool guy. He's down to earth. Uh, we like to talk movies a lot. Whether we agree or disagree, we always respect each other's opinions. And I love just doing videos a lot with this guy. And I thank him because of him having me collaborate on his channel. Like I reviewed Terminator Genesis with him. I reviewed Divergent with him, A Million Ways to Die in the West. And there's other ones as well. Like I collaborated with him with Indiana Jones and the Temple of Doom and there's others as well. With those videos, because he has more subscribers than I do, his videos have helped me grow the ones I collaborated with him on and seriously Justin thank you so much for what you do buddy and thanks for helping my channel grow I will always really appreciate that the next person I actually have to get to give a shout out to and um, he's probably the first youtuber I've ever had the privilege to talk to that is none other than Movie Man Chad. I think Movie Man Chad is literally the first YouTuber I've ever gotten to talk to. As soon as I talked to the guy, I mean, I was chill. I was just laid back. We talked a lot about movies. We talked a lot about each other's channels. And he was just a very cool guy. You could see his passion. Chad, I want to thank you for not only the Skype calls we would have, but I also want to thank him because his shout outs and a couple of his reviews have really helped me. Like when I talked to him for the first time, he gave me a shout out in his old boy movie review. You know that movie with Josh Brolin when he reviewed that movie back in 2013 because that's when I got to talk to him for the first time. He gave me a shout out at the end of that video. I really appreciate that. And when he did give me a shout out, I did notice an increase in my subscribers and it's because of that one shout out he gave me in that review I have to thank him for. Oh, and he even gave me a shout out in the Spongebob movie, Sponge Out of Water movie review because the dude knows that I freaking love Spongebob. He knows that I'm a huge Spongebob fan. Oh, and I also have to thank him for sending me 
the SpongeBob movie Sponge Out of Water poster. He sent me the Blu-ray for Prometheus. He's very supportive of the channels and the YouTube community and movies and I respect this guy's passion in all honesty. I just respect this guy in general. I love watching his channel. Thank you Movie Man Chad. You know you're one of the people that help my subscribers raise and I'm always going to be very grateful for that buddy. So thank you very much for that. Next person I have to thank is JW Universe because when he used to do subscribers of the week he gave me a shout out as part of his segment and that actually helped me a little bit with the subscribers and JW Universe he's been in a couple of my live Q&A's very awesome to talk to him the first time I got to talk to him was when I went on jacksig 99s live stream oh and jacksig 99 very cool dude but when JW Universe gave me that shout out it was like wow because he is actually probably one of the first YouTubers after I started this channel and doing videos that I got to discover and then from there I discovered Brian's channel and then you know all the other YouTubers out there so JW Universe thank you for your shout out and thanks for everything you've done thanks for your support buddy and just for being a good friend in general I always appreciate it man you rock the next YouTuber I have to give a huge thank you to is actually something very recently and that's actually to Comic Uno I'm thanking Comic Uno because she does this thing called the Annual Geeky Awards and she just recently posted the video of all the winners up on her channel if you want to check it out. I was nominated for Best Movie Reviewer for the 4th Annual Geeky Awards. I didn't win it but I was nominated for it and that's where I have to thank Comic Uno because I noticed ever since I got nominated I've been noticing more increases into my subscribers and more people I think have been recognizing me because of that award show because of that nomination and it's thanks to not only her having me nominated but her actually coming up with that award show because it's the award show where she wanted to have fun and bring all of these youtubers you know bring in so many different people because when I won the Geeky Awards, I had no idea who most of the people were. And it's also thanks to that awards show that I get to see some of the YouTubers that I haven't been familiar with. Cat from Comic Uno, thank you very much. And yeah, just to be nominated, it really does mean a lot. Now, I have to give thank you to my inspirations. The ones I would watch before I actually started my 22 Tiger Dude channel. These are literally the only channels I would watch before I started my own channel and they are the reasons why 22 Tiger Dude even happened. Jeremy Johns, Chris Duckman, The Flick Pick, um, Schmozno, Stephen Hunt, and Nick Yakabuchi. These would be the only YouTubers I would watch before I start my own 22 Tiger Dude channel. When I would watch their videos, I was all like, man, that looks like something so cool. And they really inspired me to just go out and start my channel because I was like, I could do that. That could be something cool for me to do. I wasn't sure if it was going to work out. Luckily, my channel ended up working out because of you awesome people. But yeah, I have all of these guys to thank. So, and I know pretty much most of them aren't going to watch this video, but in case they are, seriously, you guys, thank you so much for being my inspirations for starting this YouTube channel. This channel would not be possible without you guys inspiring me to start this channel. The one critic, may he rest in peace, that inspired me to have more appreciation on the overall filmmaking of movies, and that has to be Roger Ebert. Roger Ebert was the movie critic that I would always go to online to see his opinion. And whether I agreed or disagreed with the guys, I always loved his reviews because I truly do believe that films are all opinions. No matter what film it is, they're always going to be opinions. And that's the kind of goal I want to set up for this channel like what Roger Ebert did for the world. Just showing that you can 
watch a movie, express your opinion. You know, if you hate a movie, say why you hate that movie. If you like the movie, say why you like that movie. And he is the reason I do use my four out of four star rating system here on my channel. You know, it's my way to honor Roger Ebert. And honestly, it is the rating system I really love to use. I know there's letter grades and five out of five scales, but personally, even though, yeah, I'll use those as well on occasions when people ask me, I still like to just use the four out of four star system because it just feels more right like that in my opinion. So thank you so much to Roger Ebert for having me become the movie lover that I am today. And now, next, I have to give a huge thank you to my best friends. Um, Julio, Saran Reyes J, and Luis, One Young Swag 5. Um, I've known Saran Reyes J since kindergarten, and I've known One Young Swag 5 Luis since third grade. I'm just so lucky to have these two part of my lives, and these two have been very supportive with my channel. Since the day I started my channel, these two have always been supportive of me. They always tell me to go for it. And you know, it's cool that now One Young Swag 5 has his own channel, and, and I think maybe, maybe Huya will have his own too. I always love doing videos with them whenever I can because I know they get busy. But I know that both of them will watch my videos, especially Luis. He tells me that he watches a lot of my videos on my channel, which I really appreciate. But it really wouldn't be possible if it weren't for them actually telling me, you can do it, Tony. You know, we're always going to support you. You should do this channel. You should do what you love. And, you know, I just took their advice to consideration to heart, and I did it. So thank you to my two best friends that I'm very lucky to have. So, yeah, you guys are awesome. I have to thank my mom because she's always been very supportive. And, and I also have to thank some of my cousins because I know some of my cousins, they watch my videos, they support me. Most of them are like out of town, so every time they visit me or I go visit them, they're always telling me, good job on your channel, Tony. Keep up the great work. And it's just nice to have a huge support, not only here on the internet, but even in my own life, you know, the fact that some of my family members, you know, they support me with this channel. And even some of my friends I went to school with, you know, elementary, middle, high school. I know some of my friends that I went to school with even watch my videos. And to those friends that do know about my channel that watch my videos, I really do appreciate it. And I hope you guys are enjoying what I'm doing. It's kind of cool knowing that even after I graduated high school, that I have some friends that watch my channel, so that's always very nice. Also, as far as who my good YouTube friends are, I have to really thank these guys, and plus, I feel like I need to give them a shout out because, you know, they deserve a little something. So, of course, thank you so much to WWE Fan 0599, It Is Raining Blood, Joe Tifano, Cinemas TV, Jackson Fulcher, Trey Passer, down on Movies, Kevin Falk, The Kid of Awesome, Mega, Movie Man Mark, Brian Mendoza, Jack Sick 99, J5 3518, Green Day the Beatles, Seb Carrasco, JW Universe, and many, many, many more. Like, I could go on and on, but there's just too many great people out there here in this community and great people that I feel like I've gotten to know as the years are going by. And of course, I can't end this video without thanking my subscribers. My subscribers, you guys are what is keeping this channel together. You guys are the glue. You're my motivations. You're my reason for doing videos on my channel. Even when I get negative comments, negative messages, you know, it's the support of you guys that motivate me, that bring me up, you know, keep my tiger power strong just by watching my videos. Some of you probably don't comment, but you'll just watch my videos. And even if you just view my videos, I still really appreciate it. If you view and comment on my videos, I appreciate it, rate them. It's because of you guys. And of course, to my SpongeBob watchers, because you know, this channel is a blend of movie reviews because I love movies, but also SpongeBob reviews because I love SpongeBob SquarePants. So, 
to those that watch my movie reviews, thank you so much. Thank you for listening to what I have have to say about movies. You know, I I know I'm not a professional. I'm just a dude that expresses his opinions on movies and the fact that you guys are willing to listen to what I have to say about movies, you know, it really means a lot. And the same does go for the SpongeBob viewers, you know. Thank you to my SpongeBob viewers who would view my SpongeBob episode reviews. Whether you guys agree or disagree with whatever I have to say, I'm still very grateful that you guys actually take the time to watch the videos. I appreciate each and every one of you for your views, your comments, your rates. And this is my way to celebrate three years because 22 Tiger Dude channel does turn three years old on July 27, 2012 in terms of me starting videos. And of course, thank you for the 1,700 subs, you guys. I really, really appreciate it. Thanks for celebrating my three-year anniversary here on YouTube just by watching this. And let me know what you think of the green screen as well. I figured I just might as well test out the green screen to see how it goes as I'm going to be editing this video. So you guys rock. This is 22 Tiger Dude here. And don't forget that I will always have Tiger Power.